Dolphins hosting the Cowboys, and the Dolphins are one and a half point favorites. The over under has fallen to 49 and a half. The Cowboys are plus 110 on the money line, and the Dolphins are minus 130. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to kickoff tomorrow, and I imagine that this is probably going to be one of the heaviest bet games tomorrow just because it's the Cowboys and the Dolphins are playing well. Now, thank you for everyone who has joined my Discord and who continues to join it. If you've not done so yet, you can do so by visiting my website or clicking on the membership link in any of my social media profiles. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets and to my stats. Now, Tyreek Hill is still listed as questionable, and I imagine that's the reason why the Dolphins are only one and a half point favorites, because if they confirm that he's playing, this line goes up to like three or four. If they confirm that he's out, this game is potentially a pick em game because, you know, the Cowboys just that get that kind of respect when it comes to gambling. Now, head to head, the Cowboys are 4 0 against the Dolphins. The home team is 2 2. The favorite is 4 0 on the money line. The favorite is 3 1 against this spread. The under is 3 1. The under has hit in their last three. The under was at 51, the over under, and the under was 3 1 there. And at 49 and a half, it is still 3-1. and one. The one game that they played was in 2007. The Dolphins, uh, the Cowboys won that game 37-20 to 20 in Miami. Now, as far as the weather is concerned, it's supposed to be 74 degrees with a slight chance of rain with 13 mile an hour winds. And that's why all the snowbirds go to Florida for Christmas because 74 degrees. That's another reason why they come out here to Arizona. The Cowboys are... 7-3 and three in their last 10, they are 6-4 and four against the spread, and the over is 6-4. and four. They are 3-1 and one in their last four games. There was a total of 55, 76, 46, and then 41 points. 45 points and a 35-point win against the Commanders. 41 points and a 6-point win over the Seahawks. 33 points in a 20-point win over the Eagles. And then 10 points in a 21-point loss against the Bills in Buffalo. For the Dolphins, they are 7-3 and three in their last 10, 6-4 and four against the spread, and the over-under is 5-5. Five and five. There was a total of 47, 60, 55, and then 30 points in their last four games. 34 points in a 21-point win over the Jets, 45 points in a 30-point win over the Commanders, 27 points in a 1-point loss against the Titans, and then 30 points when they shut out the Jets in a 30-point victory. This is uh, going to be an interesting game, and I really, I really, really despise the Cowboys. And this is not me trying to pick against them because they're, they're a team that I dislike. I just think that the Dolphins need to win this game at home to prove to everyone that they are a playoff-worthy team and that they're not going to go in and just get bounced out in the first round. I'm going to take the Dolphins with the money line. I'm going to take the Dolphins laying the points. And I'm going to go over in this one. Both of these teams are very capable of putting up 27 points. I think this will be a 27-24 kind of game. And in that aspect of it, it's 51 points. The game goes over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.